Hey, Eagle Run 2-3. Uh, here's a video I had no intention of making, but uh, just kind of came out of necessity. Uh, so, stuff going on with um, the virus that's out there, and the wife said she was looking for some hand sanitizer. They didn't have what she needed. She couldn't find it. We looked on Amazon. Prices are crazy. $50, $60, $100 for hand sanitizer. Listen, you can make this stuff at home. You can do it for super cheap. Um, I don't know what these ingredients cost because I had them. Um, I got an essential oil. I got some aloe vera gel. And I have some witch hazel. You could also use rubbing alcohol. Basically, you're going to be 50-50. Um, that's how we normally make it. It's 50-50. If you want to go more, um, if you want to go more, you can go more with the witch hazel. But uh, we're just going to... just about halfway all right and just about halfway good and then we're gonna do I'm using on guard uh, you could use thieves oil you could use tea tree oil you could even use lavender and you don't even have to use an essential oil I have it so I'm going to use it. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Probably too many. Uh, oh, put the lid on. Check it up. All right, this stuff is just as effective, if not more effective. Got a nice... Uh, consistency there and spray on your hands obviously just wash your hands you know what just wash your hands you don't even have to do this but you can't always wash your hands when you're running around got to wash your hands for 30 seconds but you can see it does squirt as like the gel which is kind of cool but that's it uh, you could really do two ingredients uh, if you got essential oil, add it in there, you're good to go. There's a uh, quick video on how to make your own hand sanitizer. Eagle Run 2-3, thanks for watching.